today's video, I'll be going to NEC Birmingham to uh, visit the uh, Good Food Show at uh, the BBC Good Food Show. Uh, so, hope you enjoy this video and thumbs up and subscribe to the Happy Chef YouTube channel. At the NEC, uh, we're right outside the uh, uh, Good Food Show. It's also with the Garden uh, Show, but I'll mainly uh, film with the uh, Good Food Show. So let's go inside. Let's go Just me. Oh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Olive oil. Yeah. It's, the, the flavor is all from olive oil. Yeah. It's not. We put smoked garlic in the mayonnaise. It's smoked garlic olive oil. Yeah, that's it. See you uh, with the next part of the video. And now, please put your hands together and welcome your host, Marcus P. Uh, he ran out there. He had that moment of glory. He loved that, didn't he? 
love that, yes. Uh, very well round of applause. Ladies and gentlemen, please, let's welcome our first chef. It's the local boy, it is the yummy brummy, Lynn You ready? I'm always ready. But the thing is, um, because I'm from Birmingham, uh, I felt like I was betrayed the last time. Okay. We were just commenting on the old. Oh. So I reckon, you know, I sat in the kitchen when they show you wine, you yeah. go to Asda or wherever, that wine gets sold out straight away. Yeah. I reckon after this program, after this show, yeah, sure. Ash one sees it can be fly. Southwest, anyway. Okay. And I thought what I'd do is I'll show you how I've made this aubergine puree. Right. Um, what we do is we take the aubergine, cut it like this, and then just lacerate it. What I'd normally do is add some olive oil on top of that, yeah. put it in a smoker, and then the olive oil takes the smoke. And then once it's been smoked, we then bake them in the oven on a tray with some aluminium paper, the dribbling of olive oil, yeah. and then that will go in. So once they've been smoked, we literally, literally just cover them with, with olive oil, yeah. get a little bit of seasoning on there, Good. and um, that's just going to crack in the oven. Yeah. So we'll put that in. I'm not actually going to use this because I'll just sort of show you the process. Yeah. Now that gives me this lovely puree which I'll pick up on later. Okay. In the meantime I've got this uh, brunoise if you like. I've got uh, peppers uh, and courgettes. So in we go with uh, courgettes. This is a ratatouille. Yeah. Now I've got a thank ratatouille actually, it's actually the film. Because up until ratatouille when I told my chef I was a cook or chef, they didn't really understand it, but when I watched Ratatouille, they suddenly got it, and I was yeah, exactly. coolest dad ever. It's part, part of the training program. It is. I was going to say, what did I think they were going to cook a rat? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, but, uh, no, so we're going to cook lamb. Okay. So what I've done with the lamb... Lamb dish, yeah. This lamb is actually the water bath, so this is quite a Michelin thing, so we'll talk about that in a little minute. Okay. What I've done is sealed off the best end, put some aromats in there, garlic, thyme, rose meat. Wow. That's been cooked in the water bath, 55 degrees for two hours. If it's a saddle, we only cook it for an hour. Okay. So now what I'm doing is I'm individually cooking off the um, ratatouille. So every single uh, element of the ratatouille will cook differently. Okay. So the courgettes will cook quicker yeah. out of all of them. So what I've got here is now the red pepper. So okay. I'm using olive oil and, um, and, uh, and in a minute I'm going to put all that together back in a pan with some tomato puree and also some uh, garlic puree. puree. It's, it's almost like a, I call them like, you know, you, everybody talks about apple tartare. Yeah. It's like Just the one. Okay, so, right, Tony, come over here. Oh, look at these two, look Lovely. at these. I'll tell you what, have the brew to start, follow it with the lamb. Okay. Just need it to so, Michael, uh, sorry, let's start with Glenn. Actually, Glenn, please explain your dish. So we've got uh, brill poached in uh, spice coconut with cattle lime leaves. We've got carrots cooked in uh, toffee, passion fruit, and cumin. And that's finished with the juice of the cooking liquor. Wow. wow. Incredible. Nice. A big round of applause for that dish, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! Fantastic. And of course, please, Michael, explain Michael. your dish as well. Well, uh, this is Yummy Brummy's uh, favourite dish. <laughs> I like to cook for him. It's, uh, it's a nice Provencal lamb dish with fond of potatoes, glazed onion, smoked aubergine puree, ratatouille. Uh, that is the end of the episode, and uh, I hope you enjoyed uh, me travelling to Birmingham or yeah. seeing for the BBC uh, Good Food Show. And like, share, and subscribe to the Happy Chef YouTube channel, and hit the bell to be notified. Thanks for watching.